Ladies and gentlemen, guys, welcome back to a B welcome back to the official Bean Re channel here, guys. In today's video, guys, I've got something really, really interesting, guys, going on here, guys. Now, thank you so much for at least 70 su 72 subscribers, guys. It's went up, uh, which is really, really cool, guys. Thank you so much, whoever, whoever subscribed, guys. Um, thank you so much. Like that, my latest subscribers. Thank you so much, guys. Uh, I really do appreciate it, guys. And uh, it's going up. It's going up slowly. Like I said in the previous videos, I'm not bothered. As long as you keep enjoying my videos and keep keep an eye on when I do upload, which you all know, you need to turn that notification bell down below. You know where it is. Um, but anyway, guys. Other than that, let's get into today's video. So in today's video, guys, we're going to talk about the new patch coming for Black Ops 3, guys. The next official patch for Black Ops 3, guys. What is it going to be? Now that's the thing. The next patch, guys, Infinite Warfare has just released new DLC weapons, guys, which is pretty cool. And the new DLC weapons look absolutely amazing. I haven't seen them just yet, guys. And to be honest, I don't really play Infinite Warfare as much, so I don't really know what they actually specifically are. But they look pretty cool, whatever they are, and I think they look, they're going to be awesome. I just can't wait. They, they, now, specifically, they are snipers, which... I'm not a two of a sniper fan. Like I say, I'm not a huge sniper fan whatsoever. I've never really got into snipers. But when I saw playing Black Ops 2 a couple of weeks ago, well, not, well, I do Black Ops 2 most of the time anyway. Uh, we, I do use snipers in there. I use quite good snipers, and it's really, really cool because I use really, really good snipers, and I think they're just interesting on Black Ops 2. Snipers on Black Ops 2 were actually really, really good. To tell you the truth, they were actually really, really impressive. Um, but there again, guys, I really do like the snipers in Black Ops 2. Black Ops 3 snipers are pretty good. I don't really use them, though, like I was saying. I don't really use them whatsoever. But, anyway, guys, what is the next DLC weapons? What's the set? Because we all know World at War 2 is the beta, which is specifically out right now, guys. So when you pre-order World at War 2 on the PlayStation or the Xbox, you will get the official beta. Now, I don't know if it's just for the PlayStation or Xbox as well. I'm not really too sure what Microsoft is doing with that, but I'm really not too sure whatsoever. But, yeah, guys. The next set of weapons, guys. What do you think? Now, Black Ops 3 will die out very, very soon, guys. It already is, but the next DLC weapons we'd like to see, guys. Now, the next DLC weapons I would like to see will be pretty much... You now, the AK-47 is already in, guys, which you all know is the AK-4 something. Uh, I can't remember. AN-95, called. That's already in. Uh, that's just like a remake of on it, which is pretty cool. And then, to be honest with you, I don't know what of three. Uh, I would love to be lucky to get them, but there again, you're not going to always be lucky. You know, there's not always it's not it's not always going to be lucky. I, I would expect. But um, what weapons would I like to see? Now that's the thing, guys. I would like to see the ballistic to be added in the game from Black Ops Two, which is really really cool. And we all know the locusts like that because it pulls back and you shoot, which is awesome. The other weapon I would like to see you guys officially come back from Black Ops 2 is, now this one's been a lot talked about, which is really, really cool, um, and that is the, um, what was that weapon guys, I had it in my head and it's gone now, it was a submachine gun and it was very, very popular in Black Ops 2 actually, I think it was very, very popular indeed, um, now we all know the Peacekeeper's in. I would like to see some new meal weapons in, even though meal weapons are not the huge best to get them, but I would like to see it still, and I think it would be pretty cool to see in Black Ops 3. Um, meal weapons, what meal weapons I'd like to see? Maybe, I don't know. I would say yeah, maybe some cool meal weapons, okay? Some awesome meal weapons that we can specifically see in Black Ops 3, I would really, really be impressed with. There again, I'm not too sure. I think the meal weapons are at last, because I don't really think... They're going to add any more meal weapons in, but maybe some assault rifles or some machine guns would be pretty cool. In Black Ops 3, I think that would be very much impressive as well. Any new um, secondaries? I, that's the thing. Secondaries, guys. What do you think secondaries come, come out? Now, that's the thing. Secondaries are really, really tricky to talk about because secondaries... There's a lot of secondaries in Black Ops 3. We've got the... Um, 9-11, 1911, we've got the RK5, we've got the all them kind of guns, okay? I could just keep saying them all the time and, you know, but uh, I'm not going to, so. Uh, that's all the weapons we can even talk about there, but, uh, yeah, what what bazookas or anything, RPGs maybe? Maybe the old RPG could release, which we all know the old RPG was pretty cool. Now, to be honest with you, I'm not too sure. Old weapons could come back, though, like remakes of them, but, like, maybe the old versions may come back into Black Ops 3, which is awesome. 
Nice. Saying that though, I don't know if that would happen. I, I, I don't know if it would. But uh, other than that, guys, I will keep you notified with that. But uh, like I'm saying, I'm not too sure what's going on with it. Um, yeah, I'm not too sure. But uh, we could see some new content in a couple of weeks' time. Now, the next update for Call of Duty, I would say, is Modern Warfare Remastered. Now, I think that is the next update for the Call of Duty's to uh, not too sure guys. Now the thing what I would like to see with this patch, not just new DLC weapons though, some bug fixes maybe, and stuff like that guys which we always get, and the zombies maybe, but what what if we could see a Mob of the Dead remastered map? Now I'm going a bit too far with this because I think they're going to release that with Black Ops 4, which we all know is coming out next year. But what could we specifically see? That's the thing. What could we see? Now, in my opinion, guys, I really do not know. Now, I don't know if we could see a Mammal Fair and Mob of the Dead Remastered. Now, that's going a bit too far, okay? It was just a little guess what we could see, though. Uh, I would love to see a Mammal um, Mob of the Dead Remastered, but they will have to make... Well, it wouldn't take that a lot to do, because it's not like eight maps, it's just one. But that would be pretty cool as an idea. I would love to see that, you know? Mob of the Dead Remastered, you know? Who would not like Mob of the Dead Remastered? Mob of the Dead was the best zombies mode I've ever even played. I'm not even joking. Zombies was... For that, to me, Mob of the Dead was just a life. It was incredible. Uh, it was really, really incredible. To be honest with you, I think, to be honest with you, I think they will put it in, in Black Ops 4. I'm not saying they won't bring it in uh, Black Ops 3 because that won't be the case. It won't be. I don't think they will. But it was just a little guess what they could release. The next one, it, I, now this one is pretty cool, but I don't know if it would work. K9 units. Now K9 units, you all know, with attack dogs and you know they were in the previous old Call of Duties as well, but I don't know if they will bring them back. Now Black Ops 4 is officially um, coming up next year, so I would say they're going to bring them in right on there. But there again, I'm not saying anything about it because we don't know any information about Black Ops 4 because obviously it's not going to come up till next year, which is 2018. So we don't really know what's going on with the K9 units. I don't know if they'll bring them back as a kill streak because mostly what's taken over them is pretty much the wraps because the wraps are them drones, them spiky robots, and they will pretty much blow up whoever they go next to, which is uh, it's a pretty good kill streak. But to be honest, I don't use it, so <laughs> I can't see anything about it. Um, but if you get in the care package, I would definitely tell you. Hell yeah, I would use them like that. Like I'm saying, I'm not too sure if I would use it all the time because, you know, they're just they're, they're just like they're just like like I'm saying, they're just like attack dogs. That's just all they are. You know, they're just robots. They're just futuristic versions of them, which they clearly they're not dogs. They're raps, but spiky raps. But uh, yeah, guys, that's all we could see there. I would say more gestures as well. New gestures. I'm not too fussed on them, but it's always nice to see some new gestures in Black Ops 3 because it's just gestures. Now the thing is, the dab's already in and all that, guys. We, we, we all know specifically know this. The dab's in. It's been in Call of Duty for a while now, and uh, Infinite Warfare I don't think has it yet. I don't think Infinite Warfare will ever have that. Saying that, I'm wrong with that because actually Infinite Warfare could have that ability, but like I'm saying, I don't think they do. Um, there's no answer to, to have that double gesture or not, but they could well add it in the near future, which is pretty cool. But I'm not really too with gestures. I'm not too fussed with them. Like I'm saying, I'm not really too big fan of them. Uh, they're not like you're gonna get a DLC weapon or anything like that. Obviously not, because they're different. <laughs> they're absolutely different. But um, yeah, guys. Now, never mind the next patch, guys, which is 1.60, I think. Is it 1.60? I can't remember specifically. Round up the number, but uh, yeah, pretty cool to see some new DLC weapons and some cool stuff. And uh, I would like to see it specifically, but. There again, we don't have official answers when the next patch is up and running. I would say pretty much next week, because GTA 5 is getting a new DLC, which you all know is coming out next Tuesday, which is pretty cool, guys, and I cannot wait for that. And uh, I will be doing a live stream tonight, at least, guys. If you want to check the next live stream, guys, it will come at least maybe 2.30 in the morning. So if you want to check that live stream, guys, if you want to go straight to my Twitch channel, guys, that's where I'll be live streaming. And it will go straight to YouTube after, guys. So all my subscribers can see it. But all my followers, guys, you can go straight to my um, Twitch channel and check it out, guys. It's really, really cool. I do some awesome live streams on there. I do Black Ops 3. I do all sorts, guys. I do all sorts. So if you want to check my content out, guys, go 
go ahead and check my content out. Now if you want to check with the rest of my friends, which all, all you know is part of my clan, uh, you can go and check their videos out guys, we do post videos, not like daily, but um, it doesn't matter, you know, it doesn't matter if it's daily or, you know, anytime, it could be anytime, you know, as long as you watch them and check their content out, which you all know is right on my channel, you'll see the, um, if you don't know where my friends are guys, go straight to the channels and you will see check the rest of the clan and they're right there so it's pretty it's pretty easy to find so if you want to check it out go ahead and check my friends out and subscribe to them if you so want to if you want to join the clan guys comment down below i want to join and i will maybe i could add you or anything like that i don't know um but yeah if you want to join the clan you're more welcome to become a subscriber and you've joined the club which is pretty cool um and i hopefully you enjoyed this video guys if you did all the new um thing for multiplayer now search and destroy specifically has got a new um, mode pretty much and you know it's not really a new mode but you're gonna get double weapon xp which is pretty cool actually that i i'm not really too fussed with that mode so i won't be playing it as much because it's not double crypto keys or anything like that it's just double weapon xp which I'm not really too fussed on, but uh, hopefully the next one is going to be double crypto keys because double crypto keys. Oh my god, I've got you a lot of crypto keys, but fingers crossed it'll be a different mode like domination or something like that. That would be awesome. But guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. If you did, smash that like button, guys. Make sure to subscribe. Stay tuned on my channel, guys, for the next live stream, guys. It is coming your way very, very, very soon, guys. And guys, have an awesome day or awesome night. It depends where you are. And guys. See you in the next video.